hello guys welcome back to my channel this is shades of my day today we'll be designing another party flyer in a new dimension so sit back relax and enjoy and learn so let's dive straight let's dive, let's dive straight into it rather so we the page size is 2000 by 2000 pixel so we're dragging our first image background plugin our first background so you create new layer new layer here right so you click solid color on your keyboard you can just press zero that is for the black color then you can reduce the opacity the field to around 60 c60 or any anyone you are against sixty two. This is like this. So let's um, add curve to make it a little bit darker. Let's add curve to it. Our curve here. Can drag this a little bit to make it darker. Yeah, make it darker. Let's drag in our overlay image. Drag in our overlay image. Drag it over the image. Change the blend mode to, to add light. Add light. We can reduce the fill and the opacity. 72. Let's try this. So let's try for the Let's it has 47. This is quite cool. So let's begin our speaker. I actually made everything very simple as usual, so you won't you will not need to go through all the stress again. Drag this in, drag in your speaker, you know. Just like this. You can extend, you can increase the size, extend the size. Filter blur gush blur gushing blur. You know, let's try and Let's leave it at nine and or nine or eight point nine shall. Okay, nine point six. Yeah, nine point eight. So your keyboard just press Ctrl J, then Ctrl T to transform. Right click and flip vertical. Oops, sorry. Ctrl Z. Ctrl Z. You flip horizontal so you drag at the same line you see this click ok click ok so it's together like this it's together you can do, bring this out a little bit what you do next is drag in the guy image as usual drag in the guy's image let's make let's put this behind the speakers something like this yes so now you create clipping uh, create a layer mask here for the guy's image so let us blow out these edges a little bit so you come to your gradient tool here with your foreground color set to black you drag this in gently drag this in gently 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 i think this is okay this is quite okay so above all this click on your speaker create new layer foreground color set to black also gradient to gradient to drag gently gently so if this is too much for you, you can reduce the opacity a little bit yes something like this So before we start adding some stuff, let's make the background a little bit more lively. So what we'll do next is drag in our fire overlay. Place it behind the guy's image. 
the blend mode let us change it to, to probably screen no screen is too much screen too much okay let's change the screen and reduce the opacity reduce the opacity yeah opacity like this So create clear mask on your keyboard, press B for brush. While your foreground color is set to black, you can gently brush like this. Click OK. So on your keyboard, press Ctrl J, Ctrl T as usual. Flip horizontal. So you can drag this like this. Just like this. Now we're going to try. We're going to do something first. Very different now. So on your keyboard, create a new layer. So change this color to around this um, is it um, orange? Is it orange here? Yes, something like this. Something of this color. So on your keyboard, press B. Keyboard press B. Click once on the glass, change the blend mode to color dodge add. On your keyboard, press Ctrl J. Press Ctrl J again. Ctrl J. So while pressing Ctrl J, you just drag this here. Ctrl J. I'm sorry. Ctrl J. Ctrl J, Ctrl J, Ctrl J, delete. Goes over the glass. Let's fill up this one too. Ctrl J. So it's looking more like what we agreed. So you can actually add a little bit flat to your to your necklace to your chains. Ctrl J. You can drag this here. You know. Ctrl T on your keyboard. Reduce this. You know something like this. Drag this to make it look more stylish. Then Ctrl J, Ctrl J again. Ctrl J is for duplicating. Ctrl J, so it's looking more lively now. Something like this. What I always do is, I always work on my background. So let's bring in my overlay, another overlay. Drag this in. Change the blend mode to screen. Yes, screen to screen. Reduce the opacity. You can actually drag. Come in. It has to be on the image to make it look fun drag this like this yeah to make it look fun so as usual in all my videos i skip some parts to save time because i've already shared the psa file so i'll be showing you how i got every of these stuff so this um dollar image here yeah? this dollar image let me look for sorry only for the image the dollar and this dollar image i actually shared the i'll be sharing the file in the link below it will be together with the psd file so i added the motion blur effect to it to make it look like it's moving angle minus 90 distance 49 so what i did again here was you know i changed the, the blend mode here from um so this um, the blend mode from screen to linear dodge add for the flare for the fire flare and for this party let me show you how I did the party I used um, a font called Stretch Pro. This is a very unique font in the sense that you if you type two letters together it will it will stretch the, the text something like this 
sorry sorry let me something like this you see that has already stretched the text so like i doubled the text meanwhile it will be while it will be merged together if you, if you, if you write a text together like this let me, let me do it again for you do it again for you so let's delete one of this one of this and write double p right in front you can put another p like this you see that it's already stretched you see that it's already stretched so you click let me reduce the p so i used her mine was r so it stretched like this so that's how you you use the font if you double the text if you write another text in front of the the, the, the previous text it will double it it will stretch the text for you automatically so for the effects i used stroke i used stroke in for the size i use six for the position I, for the position i used inside blend mode screen opacity 70 for the stroke then color you can see ffe 3c that's yellow then outer glue i used screen opacity 26 noise zero then for the same color ffe 43 then range 50 jitter zero then for the drop shadow opacity 69 blend mode multiply multiply um, spread 34 size 5 then noise 0 then I added another drop shadow again meanwhile I changing the color of the drop shadow the blend mode is normal and the color is FF7800 angle 120 size 36 noise and everything 0 0 click OK so let me see for this shape, I I I drew a, a, a rectangle too, and I added the same effect. I copy and pasted the same effect for the party flyer on this um Elebushi um rectangle. Then this for this I changed. I I created this. I converted it to to um smart object so, so I can move together. So I I wrote down this text and I created this. It's simple, so I can use it for all my videos. So that's exactly how I did this. So you can also use all these things for your videos too. You can interchange with the images and everything. You can interchange for the drinks and all. And you can decide to switch up the text and do some other stuff too. So that was how I, I got this design. So please subscribe to my channel and watch my other videos. I'll be posting videos now every seven seven days, or probably twice in seven days. I'll be posting videos. So thank you so much and. Be blessed. Thank you.